Hey y'all. Haven't forgot about you. Sitting here with my co-pilot this evening. Ocelot, say hello. Or just scratch yourself. And then lick yourself. How pleasant. Anyway, um, <laughs> uh, I haven't been around much in like a week. I figured I'd just say what's up to everybody. Scratch my nose and then play with my hair. And act like a cat for for a moment. No, but uh don't really have much to say. I'm drained from the gym. I'm trying to keep it up and it has been a struggle. Woo it is a struggle and it's only been like a month and I'm just like, please, no more. Why won't the fat just go away? Just go away, fat. But you know what? It puts things in perspective. I tell you, you know, uh a lot of people that kinda I guess you could say let themselves go or or have weight struggles in life or whatever, um, it really makes you feel for them. And I'm not saying, like, be one of those people that's like, oh, don't pick on fat people. It's like, well, you know, don't pick on them, but be real at the same time. It's like me, sitting on my butt, eating Snickers, playing video games, got me fat. Now, I could sit here and pussyfoot around that and be like, oh, it was just because I was depressed and I wasn't happy. True. I hadn't been happy for a little while. I got a little depressed a little while back. Um, so that is true, but the fact of the matter is I played video games and ate Snickers and ate ice cream and, you know, it makes you fat. And I didn't exercise. But what I was going to say is uh, it really gives you perspective on when you're working out and you're trying to get this little bit, you know, I consider I have a little bit of fat. You know, I got a little pot belly. There's some people out there that, you know, they're hundreds of pounds overweight whoo man i feel for them you know that's got to be a huge challenge to get all that weight off and i know this is all elementary i mean of course it is you know it's, oh, duh right of course it's hard to get all that that weight off but i'm just saying really you know if you really stop and think about it you know that's that's a big challenge for them and um uh, more power to them and i'll tell you something else that helped me recently stick on my workout i saw uh, one of my friends, Catherine, she posted this video, and um, it was this guy that had an artificial heart, and he was going to the gym every day. And I was like, dang, man, this guy's got like a robot heart. You know, he literally has this machine hanging out of his chest and everything, like Crank 2. I don't know if you guys have seen that movie, but, you I mean, he literally had like an artificial heart with batteries plugged into it, and he was like super fit. And it's like, dude, you know, when you see people like that, it's like, I got it easy, man. Just go to the gym and control your mouth. You know, that's what I tell myself in the mirror. I'm like, control your mouth. But <laughs> but seriously, I mean, it really does kind of put it in perspective and uh, giving you, give you a little bit of empathy uh, towards somebody that you see that has, has gained a lot of weight and they're trying to, to change that. So, anyway, I'm tired. My co-pilot over here is... He's uh taking it easy. Hey Oss. Yeah, you heard me. I see you looking back. You're on camera, Oss a lot. You're on camera. Don't you want to say anything? I'll turn you around where everybody can see you. Are you fat? Maybe you need to go to the gym. Hey. You need to go to the gym. You need to work that pudge off. You trying to eat my finger? Ah oh, well thank you. That was very nice of you. He's he's a nice young man. Good old Ocelot. You know, that's a funny thing, too. There's probably some of my friends that are watching this and like, he has a cat? He used to hate cats. It's true. I used to absolutely hate them. Then I got this little fart here, and uh, he changed my mind on that. He's he's one of the coolest little, little pets I could ever ask for. But anyway, I'm going to stop rambling on at this point. I uh, hope everybody's having a great week. Got my software. I got the Adobe uh creative suite so i've got software now i just need a camera and an upgrade on my pc and i hope to be bringing some funny stuff instead of these stupid vlogs but uh love y'all have a great uh i don't know i might see you in a few days we'll see